Welcome to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast with Jacob Ayers, providing actionable content to help you along your journey to financial freedom through real estate investing. As the premier asset class, real estate has helped ordinary people just like you amass fortunes. The benefits of passive income from real estate investing will allow you to live a life you want. And now your host, entrepreneur, real estate investor, and apartment deal syndicator, Jacob Ayers. Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom Podcast, Episode 78. You're listening to Friday Fundamentals with your host, Jacob Ayers. Thanks so much for tuning in to yet another episode. I'm so glad you're here. Now with listeners from over 35 different nations, from the Netherlands to Nicaragua to Nepal, I bring you this week's episode of Friday Fundamentals. This week's Friday Fundamental is becoming comfortable with the uncomfortable. Being uncomfortable is, well, uncomfortable. There are different types of discomfort, from the kind you feel when you're being pulled to the top of that roller coaster with the impending drop to the bottom, to that feeling in your gut when you're asking your boss for a raise with sweaty palms and a beating heart. Being uncomfortable is natural. It's human nature to always be on the lookout for danger. This nature is why you get uncomfortable when trying something new. You're not sure what dangers are hidden. However, it's in this stage of discomfort that you grow and experience new things. Brian Tracy famously said, move out of your comfort zone. You can only grow if you are willing to feel awkward and uncomfortable when you try something new. We as humans naturally avoid feelings of discomfort. If something is uncomfortable for us, we immediately begin to make ourselves comfortable by fixing the problem, removing ourselves from it, or anything that will get us back to that feeling of comfort and safety. If you're ever going to do something new, and especially bold, you'll probably be uncomfortable. For example, buying your first rental property, going to that first real estate meetup, submitting your very first offer on a property, or closing on the biggest deal you've ever done are all things that will make you uncomfortable. Relish in these times of discomfort. They're signs you are growing and taking on new things. Become comfortable with being uncomfortable. Understand it's just a feeling that will eventually pass. You'll eventually become comfortable with the things that initially make you a bit nervous. Continue to take on new challenges outside of your comfort zone. Never become complacent. Many people rarely push themselves to a point of discomfort and therefore don't grow. They don't take chances on new things or create new experiences. Eventually for you, being comfortable will become uncomfortable because you'll realize you're not pushing yourself. So get out there and do something outside your comfort zone. Take on new challenges, build new things, Launch that product, buy that property, start that business, take that course, travel to that new place. Whatever you do, stay uncomfortable. That wraps up this week's episode of Friday Fundamentals. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If so, let me know what you thought. Leave me a rating and review on whichever platform you're listening on, or drop me a note on social media. If you have any questions or comments or want to hear something or someone specific, reach out to me. You can contact me at www.jacobayers.com forward slash contact. Till next week, signing off. I'm your host, Jacob Ayers. You've been listening to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast, providing you actionable content to build your real estate empire. Nothing on this show should be considered specific, personal, or professional advice. Please consult an appropriate tax, legal, real estate, financial, or business professional for personal advice. The opinions of guests are their own. Information is not guaranteed. All investment strategies have a potential for profit or loss. The host is operating on behalf of the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom, LLC, exclusively.